Hi everyone, I'm Jerry Green, Director of Supply Chain Management. We're gonna see how the supply chain process works at Mary Greeley. From contracts and purchasing, to our primary hub and central stores, to its final destination, located in the department's clean supply room. The process to bring product into the hospital isn't quite as easy as going to Amazon and ordering it. We have a complex process to make sure that any item we bring into the hospital is safe for our patients, safe for our clinicians, and easy to use. But just how complex is the process? The supply chain management process ensures that once product needs have been identified, all stakeholders are notified and included. Every step requires action and review to make sure that the product meets all of Mary Greeley's requirements. The first step in this process is value analysis. Value analysis teams, or VAT, are chaired by supply chain management and are the foundation used to review new item requests, product changes, and product replacements. This multidisciplinary team reviews all items before they were brought in for use. Some of the questions a team may ask are, is it safe for our patients and clinicians? What is the purpose of the item? Does the product support a big dot goal? Will it improve patient outcomes? Will it improve clinical workflows? What's the cost? Is it on a contract? Who will this impact? A single department or multiple departments? Based on VAT recommendations, we would go to trial. After completion of the trial, the results are reviewed and VAT will approve or deny bringing the product in. Contract coordinators manage many different types of contracts for thousands of products and over 300 pieces of equipment. Many of these contracts are negotiated locally, but some are regional while others are tied to our GPO, Premier. All executed contracts are loaded into our contract database, OnBase. Periodic reviews based on performance measures are established and three to six months prior to the expiration of the contract, we open negotiations. All new products are also added to our ERP INFOR after VAT approval. Buyers are responsible for procuring all medical supplies and equipment necessary for patient care. Their daily duties typically include analyzing inventory levels, placing orders, tracking deliveries, rectifying invoice discrepancies, and evaluating supplier performance to ensure quality and cost effectiveness. They also collaborate with other departments to forecast demand and optimize purchasing strategies to support efficient healthcare delivery. In calendar year 2023, supply chain buyers placed over 18,000 POs with more than 67,000 lines. I have the privilege of working with the team that you see moving supplies and linen around the hospital each and every day. Our main responsibility lies in getting everything that comes to the hospital from the dock to the point of use. Ultimately, we work behind the scenes to deliver the supplies, the staff, and what the patient needs to the place where it needs to be used at the time it needs to be used. Each morning, we receive the inventory we need to keep stores and every department stocked. We typically unload between four and eight pallets of product from our main distributors each day. We also get in between 100 and 200 packages from FedEx, UPS, Amazon, and several other carriers each day. Everything is verified, checked into our ERP system info, and routed to either our store's shelves or to a cart for delivery to a department. The items on our shelves are all inventory tracked, so we know what we have and can order what we need. As we count department supply locations, we generate a list of what is needed and return to stores to pick orders. We also pick the orders that we have had requested through Infor, Epic, phone calls, or in-person requests. Everything is assigned a bin location and our order pick lists allow us to efficiently pull items to fill requests. Once we have the supplies picked, we make our way back to the departments to stock the supply rooms. Just like in stores, everything has an assigned bin so department staff knows where to find what they need and distribution techs can quickly put things away. We have a rotation established that takes us to most departments once or twice a week depending on their need. In addition to the items we stock, there are many items that come in and go directly to the requesting department to be managed and used. We deliver these every afternoon as we make our way to every corner of the hospital. And then our courier delivers supplies to all of our satellite locations like Hospice House, Story City, Transitional Living. We even do a daily run to the Boone Hospital where we pick up their lab specimens and we bring them back to Mary Greeley where our lab technicians run the tests. Some of the daily activities performed in our copy center mail room include handling incoming and outgoing mail, 
fixing postage to 250,000 envelopes each year. Other activities include operating office equipment such as copiers and printers to fulfill printing and copying requests. Additionally, we provide binding and laminating services. Hospitals need linen, and we got linen. We generate over a million pounds of soiled linen a year, which is one of the reasons why we don't launder it here on site. We have deliveries five days a week, Monday through Friday. Our linen techs run linen throughout the house seven days a week. Once a year, we do a site visit with our linen processor. Why don't you come along with us this year? Midwest Healthcare Linen Services, or MHLS, processes 80,000 pounds of soiled linen every day, totaling 21 million pounds a year, 1.2 million of those pounds coming from Mary Greeley. Mary Greeley is the only one of 34 hospitals serviced by MHLS who owns their own linen. All other hospitals rent their linen from MHLS. We purchase our own linen to maintain the quality standards our patients have come to expect. What I want everyone to take away from this video is to gain a better understanding of the scope of services provided by Supply Chain. This extremely knowledgeable and dedicated team is so much more than moving boxes from point A to point B. The work Supply Chain does affects everyone who walks through our doors. Everything we do is to support you and our patients.